All right, Kurt, how you doing? Uh, my first time commenter, well, first time to your channel here. I uh, just cruising around and uh, found your channel through uh, Ice Bike Collab and thought I'd comment on your uh, brother husbands. I understand that uh, you're giving an alternative definition to brother husbands, but you should know that there is an official definition that is not so nice. Let's put it that way anyways. Uh, and you'll get why in a bit. Um, these are, these definitions come from many, many decades ago when, uh, let's say, once again or prior to this uh, generation's love is love and uh, as long as you're happy with the person, it's okay. Uh, there was that attitude once again or prior to this attitude and brother husband and sister wives come from a culture that uh, is common to the Euro European royalty to uh, Polynesian royalty to many of these different uh, royal, royal um, families shall we say uh, where the sister wife or wives were um, actually your sister right then you had uh, mom wives, you had brother husbands, in other words your brother is your husband, you had father husbands, uh, in other words uh, they kept the, uh, the breeding, the inbreeding, uh, and that's what it's called, inbreeding uh, to in, within the family, and uh, this was to keep the royal bloodline going. And these are the original terms for the brother wives the sister, uh, the, uh, the brother husbands, sister husbands, uh, sister, I should say sister wives. <laughs> uh, got a little bit jumbled up there. Uh, but we're coming back to that period of time again in history where uh, even um, child brides uh, as young as three years old uh, will be commonplace uh, because there is a movement in India and, and in other places. Uh, and the, the movements in India have never really died out is that in, in India if you look at the uh, history of the Dalits there's a group of people called Dalits in uh, India and you will find that it is lawful for a Indian man to marry a three-year-old Indian girl uh, and, and, and if this sounds shocking it, it actually occurs across more more cultures than you would, than you would imagine so these things, as we open uh, this whole issue of, uh, uh, to gay marriage and who can marry whom, uh, comes up and we say, oh, wow, well, love is love, then, well, you've now opened the Pandora's box of history and all these other alternative families now are permissible because you can't say yes to one particular group of people and say no to another. And so now the problem is going to come up, well, where do you draw that line of who can marry whom? So, anyways, I uh, thought this would be an interesting tidbit for your, for your uh, brother husbands. I know I'm not exactly in your uh, category of where, that I would qualify for this, but most people, most girls, you end up running away from me. But, <laughs> anyways, it was nice talking to you. All right, bye-bye.